Before you begin, remove the battery and switch cover. Remove the three 3mm P00 Phillips head screws that secure the keyboard to the top cover. Slide the keyboard towards the rear of the notebook to release the retaining tabs. Flip the keyboard towards the right side of the notebook and rest it face down. Gently lift the locking bar on the keyboard ZIF connector and remove the ribbon cable. Important, use care to prevent damaging the ZIF connector and ribbon cable. Remove the keyboard from the base enclosure. Place the keyboard face down on the palm rod. Insert the keyboard ribbon cable into the ZIF connector on the system board. Important, use care to prevent damaging the ZIF connector and ribbon cable. Push the locking bar down to secure the keyboard cable in the ZIF connector. Flip the keyboard towards the center of the notebook and align the retaining tabs on the front of the keyboard with the slots on the base enclosure. Press down on the outside edges of the keyboard to insert the remaining tabs into their respective slots. While pressing down on the front and rear edges, slide the keyboard forward until it is securely seated under the lip of the palm rest. Replace the three 3mm P00 Phillips head screws that secure the keyboard to the top cover.